Welcome back to the non-stop D&D complaining hour. Here with Sivvy and Parker, who has to listen to it. I'm uh, pretty good at listening. How do you feel about the changes they made in D&D 5.0? Or whatever number they're at. I didn't, I didn't play much of 5.0. People kept trying to get me to play it, but I was getting kind of bored of D&D at the time. I, it was mainly because I couldn't make a character I actually like. Liked. That's still my problem whenever I play pen and paper games, is I can't get a character that I really enjoy. Which is the reason why I end up getting like a bit like tied for decision making, is because I'm trying to get in character, but I, I, I just can't get into character because I don't like the character enough. I, Most of the time that's what it is. You know what? That's the, like, when I first started like hearing about 5, that's, that's the first thing I thought of. I'm like, well, none of this shit's going to work backwards. So we're gonna have like three character classes or some dumb shit like that. It turned out to be like six or something, but still. Like that's not enough anymore with what people like. Which is to make, you know. Ooh, you? Apparently I deal 5,000 damage in one shot. Uh. I can't remember it. Um, I did like, I, I did like a bit of it though. Uh, it had some like decent systems involved in it. It, like, it has some, it has some systems if I recall. I only kind of listened to the like people making characters part. It has some systems that gives your character backstory, which is great for people who suck at making backstory. Yeah, that that was something I had a problem useful. with. Because I was like, I have my own back. I want to make my own backstory. I don't want to be involved with this. Like I'm a silent protagonist who doesn't talk. Or something I mean, like there's, that. And it's like, well, I, I think those rules that. are supposed to be optional. Yeah, probably. Because I mean, they don't give you any like stats, right? I don't. I don't think, think so. so. I think they might give you like cash or like a job, but they don't give you stats. E even if they do, if you have a GM who's not a fucking idiot, he can easily just be like, okay, this is kind of like the thing you want to do. Oh, thanks. Which I think, I think that skill is very important for any GM or any chef. The ability to make substitutions. Yeah. Especially if you want to make like your own sort of story where you require, you know, monsters and stuff. It's like, you don't want to write all those fucking monsters. So you can just reskin and steal stuff rather than just rewriting it all. Yeah, the one guy I, uh, I, I was playing games with for the longest time, he had all of his own custom stories, I believe. It was As just unfortunate should, that he had some very odd decision-making when it came to certain creatures and stuff. And, and you, put it, you put it right in the pussy. He just had some, like, unfortunate decision-making with certain things that ended up pissing off everybody who he was playing with. We're, I didn't really care because Were certain was... enemies only evil? That's the thing I hate the most. What's that? Were certain enemies only evil? That's the thing I hate the most. Like, like, certain colors of dragon, always evil. What? Like, they were born that way. Yeah, Colt had that problem. I fucking hate that shit. I feel not uh, cool. Uh, his, uh, he was making a character that was like, it wasn't like a dragon, but it was like somebody who was like, had a dragon familiar, and like, he didn't really know anything about dragon lore, and the GM just fucking pulled that shit on him, like, right immediately. See, you can go two ways with that and make that, like, really funny, where, like, the familiar has to listen to him, but he's just, like, egging him on to kind of be evil all the time. It was like something really weird. Cole had, I mean, Cole had a really weird character. I don't really remember a lot about it. All I know is that the GM had a character who was a dragon, and the dragon got really pissed at him because he was stated like an evil color, and the dragon was a. Actually, you should get that. Get what? Uh, oh. you got, you, I think you ended up getting it. It's the extra life thing. But you get uh, that. Uh, yeah, I yeah, know. Maybe I don't know. You Fuck got that one. I think that that was like my. My first thing when I started reading about D&D, &D. it's like, no, all these characters are always evil. It's like, what? I mean, demons and rips are like that too, though. Eh. 
Yeah. And they they, they kind of are. So that was also something I was reading. I was like, hmm, I wish I could be. I wish I could, uh, you know, chill out with a demon who wasn't trying to kill me. I mean, the with the varieties of evil in Pladium are a little different than the varieties of evil in. Oh yeah, I understand. In uh, D&D, where it's like, no, this guy will like rape children for no apparent reason, like or whatever. The D and D system is because it never makes any sense, and no one ever bothers to roleplay it properly. Everyone's just looking for a numbers game. Yeah. Whereas Plat Platinum's a little, it's still got that stuff, but it, it's it's more of like, like honor kind of stuff. This is the huge, this is the large difference. And in the end, I mean. Since I'm not particularly interested in numbers game other than seeing the most numbers, because it's funny. I'll let you play whatever you want. So I mean you could run into like a like a demon who ended up like I don't know, being raised on this really sweet planet where everyone's really nice. And he doesn't understand why everyone hates him all the time. See like that that's something that can happen in I, I a GM could make that happen in D D. Yeah. And really, it's just GM discretion for D and D, really. And the book's just like these things are gonna be evil. But then you could be like, yeah, no, he's not evil. Because I mean, you have all the power anyway to give the shit what the books say. Yeah. But I mean, the players kind of expect in D and D. Nope. That's where you get them. And that would be interesting, but that's never the case. Well, I mean, they they expect it to go by the book. That's what I mean. What if I, I told you I have eight war banners? That's a lot. I don't even know where I got all of them. Fighting dudes. I don't think we checked out uh, all the stuff on the one part of the map. Well. I don't know. I don't know, man. I I, I definitely understand where you're coming from, though. Oh, we definitely didn't go over here. I did. I did? There was a shrine again. The way it, The way it reads... It reads more like gospel than like suggestions oh, for a lot I mean, of the roles, and it's like, meh, meh, you know. I think there's nothing over here. No, there isn't. So you can go and press the button. That's where I'm going. Already on it. My like forty thousand dollars, nothing to fucking spend yeah, it on. Forty-four thousand dollars. All right, let's see. Can we get the right level? If not, we'll have to do it again. Such farm. Wow. There's gotta be something for getting every item. That took a, <laughs> that took a little while for that last dollar. Because I uh, I opened a chest. Oh. And I just did it again. God damn it, Jimmy. <laughs> Alright. Oh, oh there. there we go. I was like, oh shit. Did we, did we fuck it up? Soft lock. Oh god. Rip. Rip Roni. Man, we get money really fast. We'll never make it to HEDQ. This is happening soon. Unless you're watching this in a playlist. And then that's not the case. It may have already happened. Or it may be happening again soon. Or maybe it's SGDQ. Eh, no one wants that garbage. Which one has more Cyrano? Tell me. I think they have a couple of same. Uh, actually, no, SGDQ this year had more Cyrano. I wish that's hurt a bit, eh? Uh, I can't tell. Got full health. Ooh, syringe. Ooh, laser gun. Beep, beep, beep. I don't have as much money as I thought I did. Well, we haven't really been killing anything. I'm trying, man. I'm trying to murder. I wish they have like four thousand dollars. It's alright. Let's cut that guy. See, that would be a really cool thing that could happen in a pen and paper game. Jump pad. Cut guy as you jump up. That'd be really cool. Just 
why you don't play with people who are like super into rules a lot. You can do that. Hey, to do what I want. He can't throw me, can he? That's really loud. Jesus fuck. Yeah, and you're getting all the items for it. I don't have a problem with that. There's so many mines, by the way, where I had to fight those things. It's really lame that you attach to a, uh, like a rope whenever you get close to one. Because personally, I, I'd like to not... Oh, I found the... Found the end. You can hit the end if you want, I think. Actually, wait, there might be health shrines. One second. Uh, I just I'm, off, I'm like... gonna help you with a bunch of fucking... Uh... Missiles. Oh look, another... Captain thing. What is that? Uh, I assume that went to you. Yes, it did. Alright. I hope you liked it. I did. Oh, I fucking tried, homie. Come on. What am I supposed to do? I don't know what's going on up here. I'm only vaguely looking at the screen, but the numbers are going down. Yay. Hopefully and your number's not going down. It's kind of going down, but... It worked out. I have a lot of icicles right now. Yeah, so do I. There we go. I unlocked something for having seven monster teeth in a garden heart. Yep. I was wondering when that was gonna happen. What did I unlock? Tell me. I don't know. What have I won? More time playing this game, huh? That's not what I wanted at all. Get wrecked. Although at this point it's kind of fun. When you're when you're lethal frag levels, it's always kind of See, fun. See, this is this is where Borderlands should have went. Ridiculous. Yeah. Also, speaking of uh, ridiculous things the Vita can't handle, uh, I ended up getting in a getting in a very unfortunate situation in PSO2 where I had to fight like 20 dudes at once by myself. So, yeah. Where's my summoner? I can summon 20 skeletons, please. Um, just, just wander around looking for chests, because I don't yeah. think we got everything. Pretty sure we got everything down there. Or at least I got everything on this. Oh, there's a egg just chilling out. I don't know. I don't know what's going on in there, but it's mine now. Mine now. Feel the power of the egg. Yay. Turns out the emperor just really, you know, he just really likes eggs. Oh, there's a bot up there. Yeah, the, there's a shrine. Indeed. We only have $46,000, so we might not be able to open it. It's sad that I joke about that. Yeah, we probably do it. I'll get this one here. More rockets! I don't know what happened to that guy. I assume he died. Nothing. The uh, use item. There for garbage. Oh no. Well. I, guess I we have nine something. of those now. I guess we got some. Oh, there's a box down there that I didn't see. Nah, I, mean, I have a, I have a wheel. Oh, I have a wheel too. And whatever spawned in it didn't spawn for me, so. Oh, it spawned down here for some reason. Oh, okay. thanks, Leg. It was head stompers, so I don't think you care. No, not, not particularly. Okay. God, I hope I don't level off of uh, all of this experience we're about to get off of all the money. No. It's fucking tragic. I heal 910 by standing, though, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, you just heal a little bit. God damn it, Jimmy. If only we could go to Boar Beach. If only. If only I knew anything about that game 
that that reference came from. Maple story. I think I tried it once. I think I tried it and I couldn't actually get it working. I got it working. For sure. I think I just... I got bored. I played the Warcraft 3 uh, map of Maple Story. Close enough. Aha, I have 10 of those. Damn it, I was hoping I picked it up. It's correct. You don't, you don't need it. <laughs> I don't need to have a... Uh, a YouTube channel that has like... 800 videos on it. Yeah, getting close to a thousand videos. Yeah. You know what I do need though? More hard drive space. Heard you like frame rate. So we got rid of it. Get out of here, frame rate. Ooh, more I or um, uh plasma, plasma field. Or whatever that's called. I got an axe. Good job. And a second heaven cracker. Oh, there is totally a drone somewhere. Oh, I see it. Uh, I ran out of jumps. Found a laser drone. Found a knife. Knives are pretty good. That is not a knife, mate. This here. It's a knife. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, another drone. There's another drone here. Who needs who needs frame rate? We got drones. Who needs fucking ladders, bitch? It's true. Damn it, Jimmy. Heard you want more money. Oh, uh, yeah. Definitely gonna level from fucking the experience this time. How would you like more fireworks? The final level is gonna be bananas with fireworks. <laughs> more knives! I'm hoping that some of these fireworks actually kill those guys over there. No. Yeah, that's not quite yet. As maybe unnecessary to use that ability. Don't forget to use your, uh... That was weird. You opened that chest for me. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. It's alright. The item will probably spawn on you anyway. No, it spawned, like... The, the chest spawned, like, way down. And I was running over to it, and then you opened it from, like, way up there. And I'm like, okay. Well, so I guess dodge. I'll go sit by the the thing, so we can just get out of here quickly. Oh, I better stand in this war banner. That'll totally... Get him! Get the last enemy! Do it! Dead. Alright. That war banner radius is huge. I can't see it. Not big enough. Fucking humongous. It's more. It's almost as much as I can jump. Well, back here at least. We just see it twice in one run. Don't see it at all throughout the game. Prices of boxes, man. What is this? Canada? You're saying that we're slowly devolving into Canada? Prices? By the looks of it. I think we're slowly devolving into Australia. Whoa, let's not go that far. More ice bows. More missile drones. <laughs> Not so much attack speed now that that, like, the one attack where you go invincible, I just, like, 
It's like almost instant speed. Good sound, good sound. Better than nothing. All these fucking... You know, I played Maple Story uh, after I played Rangarok. So Maple Story was a pile of garbage. Which it kind of is anyway. Spoilers. Our Ragnarok 2 was not very good. Well, yeah. That's eight gasolines. It's, there's a reason why Warcraft or why Blizzard doesn't make a World of Warcraft 2. Because remakes are bad. Okay. Sequels don't make sense in MMO, you know, things. I mean, World of Warcraft is pretty much like World of Warcraft and Eve are pretty much like the like, hey, this is how you do it, which is just yo release upgraded graphics and stuff whenever. I guess it's supposed to be down here, the portal. I assume so because I haven't seen it. Are you just auto attacking like your normal base attack? Kind of most of the time. I have a lot of friends. I noticed. You had quite the posse there. Yeah. Yeah, it's down here. I oh, pushed a button. I did it. Some of these fire shields. Yeah, a lot of them. Yeah, 11 of them apparently. Nine barbed wires. Yep. Oh god. You know me and wire. The flying dudes only seem to come in when we start there to were a few. What's there? I couldn't yeah. see them. Uh, my my rockets quickly dealt with them. Cause you know. I don't know what's dying up there, but okay. Whatever. Who cares? <laughs> I guess it's probably our laser field getting it. Oh man. Let's see, 15, 14. Oh, my frame rate's like pretty steady. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that that is not 14 frames a second. I think they're lying to me. I'm thinking I know artists on Nico Nico who uh, can draw faster than this is framing. I, I think, think it's I'm... the stupid blobs that split into a bunch of dudes. Yeah. I think a bunch of it is uh, enemies that don't know they're dead yet. Maybe. Light screen. Yeah. Hey, look, there's a random fireworks up here, right? Sure. That reminds me, I should uh, push button. There you go. Here's another item that spawned near you somewhere. Hey, there's another box. It spawned over here for some reason. Alright, it's only crowbar number eight. Quit life. You'll never be Freeman. I should probably play that, finish that series. On stream? You mean on channel? No, just in general. But yeah, I could do it on channel too. Maybe when, uh... When I get a VR headset. Because those games already have uh, Oculus support. So I'm sure... In fact, I am like a million percent sure that all games running... Uh... The fuck There's is like their engine called? Source. Yeah, all games running Source will run five like right out the box. It's like, hey, yo, this is just a feature in our engine, which is as it should be. I'm sure Unreal will also do that. By the way, there's like two drones over here. I know. We didn't have any money when I went the other way. 
spend it all bags. On, on hookers and drugs. And experience. Drug hookers. It's it's the richest hobby where you have you pay other people to take drugs for you. Well, I mean, you know, it's probably better than just doing drugs. Yeah, only plebs do drugs. Oh, good, I can open up this chest. That's ten thousand dollars. I just got the toxic beast log. How do I? How did I not have that? That's a good question. Here's another charge generator. Great sound. Yeah, it sure is. Ten out of ten. Oh uh, wow! I really want. I wanted that item a lot sooner. You want to be able to use leech seed? Leech seed's pretty good. I like how I have two hundred ms just because there's bananas going on on the screen. <laughs> it's not because my connection's garbage. Well, it is. For some reason, I was just worried that I didn't upload Kamido Kamidori yet. Like, wait a second. It doesn't really matter if I upload it at 8 o'clock at night. It doesn't come out until 8 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. And because apparently there was no rape in it. It was pretty easy to edit. Yeah, there might be a really high rape content in the coming episodes. Oh, hi. Did you find the exit? Yep, it's over there. I just oh. want to make sure I got all the shrines first. I do believe so. I will go towards the exit. Fight me, bro. <laughs> When you get this farm, they should probably have like a secret boss that spawns. It's actually like difficult to kill. How could you have anything difficult to kill in this game? I don't know. Hmm, 420 MS. Blaze Delicious. It. Blaze the MS. I could probably play Team Fortress at 420. That's the engineer. Maybe. My wrench, it's just not connecting. We have so many of those purses that dudes literally just explode in the money. As they should. Like, we literally kill like one dude and get like a couple, like a thousand dollars. Oh god. I am become ice. I have become rockets. I don't think those missiles reach all the way over to you. I, I, a, so. I got a lot of them. It's like Macross over here. If Gundam starts the fight with lasers, Macross starts with fucking missiles. All the it missiles. Looks, it looks like the missiles that you shoot get over here. I don't even have to swing at these guys. I just jump at them and the icicles do the rest. Pretty much, icicles are like the best, best fucking shit. This is how it feels to be, uh, to be Archer. Where you just have all the stuff. Don't level up, don't level up, don't level up, don't level up, don't level up. Alright, good, didn't level up. Almost. Right, good. Almost. So close. God damn it, this is the wrong mission. Well, it doesn't matter. Remember? Yeah, that'd be a good time to end the episode, though. Yeah, I guess. I gotta fight this magma worm. Please, magma worms. I'm trying to end this thing, and I can't. I can't outro the video. Well, I could. I highly doubt they could kill me. But oh, it's a good sound to end the video with. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Beautiful. Okay. There we go. We'll see you later.
continue on our quest to try and find Acrid. It's a gentle protector that I'm going to walk away from 